There once was a cosmic firework, the likes of which the universe has never seen. What if the biggest bang you've ever imagined was just the beginning? When you hear the word fireworks, your mind conjures up images of sparkling colors dancing across the night sky. But compared to the most spectacular fireworks display in the universe, these earthly celebrations are more like a damp squib. A supernova is the ultimate cosmic firework, an explosion so bright it can outshine an entire galaxy. And when a star explodes in this way, it gives birth to the most mysterious objects in space. But what are these strange new objects, and how are they born? Let's start at the beginning. A supernova happens at the end of a massive star's life. These stars are so big that they burn through their fuel at an incredible rate. Eventually, the star's core starts to collapse in on itself. This is the point of no return. The star's internal pressure can no longer withstand the crushing weight of its own gravity. Remember those firecrackers you lit as a kid? When the internal pressure can no longer keep the fireworks' guts from escaping through the back, gravity wins and the explosion happens. But a supernova is not a gentle popping. It's a cataclysmic explosion that blasts material out into space at 18,000 miles per hour. For a brief moment, the star's core is smaller than Earth. Then something incredible happens. The core rebounds. It bounces back out, blasting the outer envelope of the star into space. This expelled material forms a glowing cloud of gas and dust. The star is now smaller than it was before the explosion. Incredibly, this whole process happens in less than a day. As the cloud of gas and dust expands, it hits the surrounding material ejected during the previous explosion. This creates a shock wave that blasts around the galaxy at 7 million miles per hour. This is the second bang of the supernova. It's the death of a star and the birth of a black hole. Some supernovae are even more energetic than others. These are the long-duration supernova. They have a second explosion about 100 days after the first. These explosions may be caused by the shock wave generated by the first explosion, heating up the gas and dust still around the star. The light from these supernovae can stay bright for years, giving scientists plenty of time to study them. By studying supernovae, scientists hope to learn more about the chemical activity occurring just before a star goes out. Now you know that when a star explodes, it doesn't just die. It gives birth to one of the most mysterious objects in the universe.